data driven leadership implies you are a leader who depends on data to make your decisions what does that really mean in reality is that each and every decisions you make as a ceo of an organization as a leader at the top of your organization you'll always consult data before you make your decision gone are the days when the leaders will depend on only intuition when the leaders will depend on experience today data is another raw material in your decision making and that's why we talk about data driven leadership and you have to wonder why is it really data driven because they say without data you are just another person with an opinion so always you have to bring in the facts to ensure that you can be able to make your decision credible supported by data and that's very critical because from the data we get the information from the information we obtain the knowledge and from that knowledge is where now as a leader as a ceo you become wise and that's the wisdom that the organization always entrusts a leader at the top of the organization and in most cases what really comes here is that you are the leader who is supposed now to start driving the data culture in the organization it begins at the top let the board buy into the idea of developing a data driven leadership if the board gets on board you realize everybody in the organization will also drive that culture that each and every data point they encounter they appreciate what that data will influence the decision making process in the organization and you'll find at the end of the day you manage to capture each and every touch point of your customer because as an organization who are you really interested with it's your client it's your customer you want to know that customer 360 degrees the behavior change today of customers most of them are digital what are they looking up to it goes down to those that those touch points so as a ceo are you data driven are you trusting data then you have to go down and see everybody in my organization should adopt our data driven culture i mentioned about the board coming on board the board buying into you a dream of being a data driven leader because what are they going to do they'll support you to have that data infrastructure do you have the architecture to manage the data they mention sometimes people always say the largest amount of data we have is unstructured data completely unorganized which means you need the current tools they are very expensive they're not cheap they're very expensive so an organization has to invest in great detail to tap into that unstructured data that's the data that will give you all the information you want to do to serve your client better at the end of that something else will be missing data strategy you've bought the idea to be a data driven leader you've managed to get your company to adopt a data driven culture the board is happy to support you you have the infrastructure therefore can you have a data strategy can you try to plan and see where will our organization be have we moved on from data awareness to now being a transformative organization